Hello, 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 and welcome back to Shake and Not Slur, where we make cocktails of all different flavors. Okay, cool. So today uh, we'll be making uh, a cocktail using red wine. Uh, this Snoop Dogg Cali Red, red wine to be exact. Um, so if you want to know exactly how to taste, uh, keep watching the video. I'll show you a little bit later on. Um, so this cocktail, and here it is right here. As you can see, the glass is a little gone because I've been uh, drinking it. Okay, tastes pretty good. Okay, cool. So this cocktail is called the Bishop Cocktail. Um, so there is a couple of differences. So you may have heard of the modern Bishop Cocktail. Uh, what we'll be making today is a classic Bishop Cocktail. Uh, the recipe is actually from a 1935 printing of the old Waldorf Astoria Bar Book uh, written by A.S. Crockett. Uh, the difference, main difference between a modern, uh, the, a modern, sorry, I can't speak. The main difference between a modern Bishop cocktail and a classic Bishop cocktail, which we'll be making today, is the fact that there is rum. So this rum essentially takes it from, you know, a classic mm -hmm. wine drink to the cocktail realm. Um, so that's what we'll be making today. It's pretty simple, actually only a couple of ingredients um, with these two being the alcoholic ingredients. So let's get right into the video. In this video, we will be tasting uh, this wine. Um, so we're actually going to be using this wine to make a drink. So this is the wine that we're using to make our Bishop cocktail. Um, it is the Cali Red wine by Snoop Dogg. Uh, you guys have probably heard of it, I have heard of it, and I have not tasted it. So on camera, this will be my first time tasting it because we have to know how it tastes before we mix it with other alcohol. You hear that? Go, 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 go. We're just going to take a little sip, put that right there. All right, wash that around. I like it. It's um, it's definitely a drier red wine, so it's not sweet at all. Um, I personally prefer drier drinks, drier wines. Um, I feel like this is definitely a wine that will get better as you take more sips. I can definitely tell that it's probably a pretty decent alcohol content. Um, so if you're a light wine drinker, you will probably end up wine drunk fairly quickly. Um, so yeah, that is my review of the Snoop Dogg wine. It is a, oh, there we go. It's actually 14% alcohol. So definitely, if you like red wine, if you like drier wines, I think this is a pretty good one. I, uh, I definitely recommend it. Cool, so let's get right into it. Uh, so this recipe, actually, I had to end up doubling it um, because it didn't make enough to fill my glass. So, uh, and it still might not fill my glass, but uh, everything is double. So essentially just I'll be telling you the single measurements but I'll be actually pouring a double so the first thing we want to do is just do uh, one and a half ounces of white rum so we'll go straight in there white rum the next we want to do is just one ounce of the red wine um, and it doesn't have to be this red wine I wanted to taste this, test it out, um, but it can be any of your favorite red wine. So we're gonna just do one ounce of this. Boom, well, you can see it kind of turned it very dark. Next, we want to go in that with about half an ounce of our simple syrup. Give it like that sweet kind of taste. We'll just dump that in there. Super simple recipe. And then we want to come behind that with about a half an ounce of freshly squeezed lime juice. And I'll try to get it in here. May have to squeeze another lime. And that's okay. You might have to squeeze multiple limes. Luckily, I have more. go oops wow almost spilled that that would have been horrible to do on camera okay let's get this lime in here 
Okay, add this half an ounce of lime. That smells amazing. Pour that in there. And then we want to add our ice. Shakey, shake, shake. Just like that. Pop this on. Give it a nice shake. Try to get this top off. There we go. Grab our glass, our strainer, and we are going to just strain that directly into here, into this glass. Nice and easy, super chilled, ready to serve. And there you guys have it. This is our classic Bishop cocktail using our white rum, our Cali Red Snoop Dogg, um, by the way, I am not sponsored by this, so no. This is pure, unbiased opinion. And I enjoy it. It actually makes the red wine kind of sweeter because of the simple syrup. And the rum kind of mellows it out. Uh, you can kind of taste the rum, but it, it definitely makes the balance between the, the red wine pretty well. So I... Uh, there you guys have it, the take on the Bishop Cocktail, a classic. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you like. These are our roses that we will be using to take the pictures. Um, so make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't. Let me know down in the comments what videos you would like to see in the future. Um, we're gonna be trying a bunch of new things. So hopefully you guys enjoy the content. So until then, check you guys later. Cut! Boop! It's a blooper, blooper sound.